This is That Night Attack Bling. Get it at otfi.com slash bling. Let's sing a song for the Ice Cream Social. You're the greatest people in the world. Are you familiar with how these songs sound? All right. <clears throat> Here we go. Here we go. Ready? Night Attack. It's a hell of a thing. Why don't you get in the Night Attack, please? That's me, Harley Sanders. I'm a Night Attack. Night Attack. It's a hell of a thing. Why don't you get into a Night Attack? It's a hell of a thing. Look at all the characters that you can bling. <laughs> bling. We want your bling to be on fleek all night. Bling. Bling. Yeah. Bling. bling. <laughs> oh. It's time to set fire to the internet. I'm sorry, internet, you had it coming. You had it coming, being all overgrown with thicket and brush and being undernourished with water. You're, you're a tinderbox ready to be set off, and that means it's got to happen tonight. Hello, beautiful people. I'm Brian Brushwood, live in Austin, Texas, joined, as always, by my BFF and OAK, it's J-R-Y, Justin Robert Young. How you doing, buddy? Oh, my God, Brian. Uh... What a what a what a couple what a couple weeks, huh? Oh man, dude, I came home so sick from Scoop Fest. I got, uh, I got the con yeah. crud, something fierce. We um, we had a good time there at at Scoop Fest. Did, did you feel it coming on when you were there, or was it just when you were leaving? The very last night, you left, and then we hung around. And we went to go see Mystere. Uh, and uh, it, I, I, I could tell during Mysterio, I was like, I am not well. Like, I thought about not going, but then I realized that I had the tickets and that I would be screwing it up for everyone else. And so I, I went and then I bowed out. Uh, you, Bryce, you did the, the after show tour, right? Yeah, that was great. The uh, uh, RJ, who plays the baby in Mysterio, gave us like the whole backstage tour. It was really awesome. Was it awesome? It was really cool. Mm, I slept. I'm sorry. Mm. Uh, you walked me into that. I'm yeah. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Way to go, jerk. <laughs> uh, so so you come back and, and you're sick. But before we 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 left Scoops Fest, uh, man, we had a great time. It was it was, it was, it was utterly fun. fantastic from beginning to end. I cannot I got to tell you, man, it's so fun to hop on stage. And weirdly, one of the things that made me the happiest is before we started, I was like, how many guys know Night Attack? And like three hands went up and I was just yeah. like, yes, fresh meats. <laughs> like, uh, like, well, uh, oh, so, so you were like excited, like, like, oh, good. There's 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 more to proselytize and not like, oh, uh, I guess this is the first time that Night Attack has ever gone in front of like a crowd we have to actually win over. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. I, I, I didn't mind that at all. Or, were, were you nervous about it in that context? Oh, no, 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 no. I, I just, uh, I, I, I uh, my, my mindset up on stage is more like I, 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 I will think about that stuff later. But when we're up there, it's just like, all right, like. If if I were super terrified, then all I would talk about is how I was super terrified because like that just has to be the the flow state of the show. Although there was this moment like like we got up on stage and, and Justin was very clear. He's like, hey, man, it's like 30 minutes till we go on. I'm like, yeah, I know. I just want to get comfortable in the space. So we get up there. We start farting around for a bit and then we get totally comfortable and we look at our watches. It's like. It's 15 minutes till we go on. Yeah, <laughs> That's right. You guys spent the two hours before that show doing brand new characters to each other <laughs> yeah. in the casino bar. You used up all of this amazing material <laughs> making each other laugh. <laughs> For like, do you want wait wait do you, do you want to do you want to do you want to do just a real quick a real quick smattering? Uh, uh, does everybody know that Bryce doesn't have Lady Siri on I, his phone? Is that right? I have Australian. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let me say. Hold on. Yeah. Hold on, we can talk to him. Funny. Penny does too. Tell me a funny joke. Oh, wait, what does Penny have on there? Two Australian iPhones walk into a bar. I oh. forget the rest. So I have Australian mail Siri. Australian oh, mail Siri. Oh. Australian mail Siri, yeah. Uh, so uh, if you could actually just hold hey, up your Siri. phone. Hey, Siri. Oh. Hey, Australian mail Siri. <clears throat> uh, which way to Adelaide? Well, 
the way you get to that, it'd be a lot easier if, if uh, uh, first, Bryce, take uh, take Justin off the screen so this is a better bit. <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> hey, Siri, which way to Adelaide? Well, first you have to go to the airport, and then you have to buy a ticket with your big, strong hands, and then you got to get on the plane, and then you got to... And then the, the dainty lady will be like, I can't rip your ticket, sir, and I'll be like, I'll rip it with my big, strong hands is what I'll do, and then I'll get on the plane, and then I'll and then I'll step off the plane, and I'll fly there with my own hands, and they'll be like wings for me, big, strong hands, and then you land in Adelaide. Oh! <laughs> Australian Siri! So you take it... That the directions work. go to the airport, and get on a plane. Get on a plane. Uh, Australian Siri, what is the tensile strength of tungsten? The tensile strength of tungsten is nothing to my big strong hands when I take it up both hands and I just bend it. Just zero, zero effort come between me. Tungsten, steel, uh, uh, frozen water, it doesn't matter. I bend it all with my big strong hands. The incredible strength you're, very, of you're very tough, Australian Siri. Uh, Australian Siri, what is the best city in Australia? The best city in Australia is anywhere where I can put my big strong hands on it and then I can take it, I'll bend it. The Sydney Opera House, I'll bend it with my big strong hands. That's the best city in the world to me. I have two hands and all they got to do is bend. Also, uh, uh, take a right on Johnson Boulevard. <laughs> Australian Siri, how, uh, what can you tell me about Auntie Donna? This is definitely not a uh, 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 Broden from Auntie Don impression, if that's what you're trying to do. <laughs> All uh, Australian sound alike. I'll take that kind of intolerance and I'll bend it with my big strong. <laughs> have, have, you ever, uh, have you ever given a baby a bottle? Oh, I gave a baby a bottle I, uh, when I gave that baby. I was holding holding that baby up with my big strong hands and I took the baby <laughs> by its feet and I took one man to the baby with its head and then I gripped it and then I fed it a bottle because I'm not <laughs> just Australian Siri. <laughs> Oh, Australian Siri, you're so kind. <laughs> well, that so that's all I hear now when I get driving directions. <laughs> my big strong. I wish I could hack your your thing so that it ends every sentence with my big strong. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, this is part of. So oh no, have him have it change your name to Big Strong Hands. <laughs> do it right, now. Here we go. I'm gonna do. Right, hold it. Uh, I want you to call me Big Strong Hands. From now on, I'll call you Big Strong Hands. <laughs> yes! <Okay. laughs> yes. Okay, Big Strong Hands. <coughs> oh my god, that's awesome! <laughs> I'm, hold on, I have to... Uh, uh, it is now updated my contact card. <laughs> As, oh, so now uh, you're Big Strong <laughs> Hands! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, so Ask go. him how to get to Adelaide. Okay, hold on. How do you get to Adelaide? Getting directions to Adelaide, Australia. Oh, it doesn't. That's not one of the ones no, where he says your name. I gotta do the bit. Like, <laughs> I would love it, dude. <laughs> he just goes on. He's like, first you get on a plane. <laughs> <laughs> what if he? What if he tell it to make a, a reminder? Will it end it with a with the big strong hands? Sounds uh -huh. like Elvis meets Australian when I do it. <laughs> uh, sure. Yeah. Set a reminder for one hour. Okay, just tell me what. Yeah, that's not good. Uh, mm. Mm. Need, we need so at any rate, we get out there, but but here's the thing. So we get on stage, we we feel everything out, and of course it's it's not our event. It's it's not necessarily our audience. We we figure out that there's you know some minor crossover, and uh, and Justin and I begin to do what I figured out when I was on tour. I figured out that that whenever there was a crowd that you were unfamiliar with and it was less than uh, 100 people, you can affect the outcome by shaping things ahead of time. So I I just I, I just uh, I, I just turned to Justin and I'm like, "Let's go out and meet every single person in the audience." <laughs> and so I just hop down and walk forward and, and hold out my hand like, "Hi, I'm Brian. Where are you from?" And then I have a conversation with literally every person and I'm not sure if it's working. And then over my shoulder, I hear Justin 
uh, do it, saying like, oh, yeah, no, Des Moines, Des Moines, Iowa. Yeah. All right. Uh, no, we literally went and met everybody. It was it was it was great. It, it felt like kind of like performance arty, and it definitely was uh, uh, pretty great. Also, it was easily the most social we were because uh, other than that, we almost like universally sequestered ourselves, uh, and not because we were necessarily trying to be away from other people. I think we were just having such a good time. We were just like horsing off. Like there was <laughs> just some grade A horsing off. Right. Uh, uh, yeah, so, uh, speaking of which, wait, but so, this is this is a great advertisement because I feel like your your United Tech albums really hit that the horsing off. Yeah, like that that heavy group. on the horsey sauce. It's like like. You you guys are are oh, entity when when you feel like nobody's listening, and then if you have a good editor, you, then you get little bits of that. So it's it's fun. Anyways, there you go. Well, so uh, Those are words. We so had one a good night. show. <laughs> we had a good show. Yeah. Yeah. And then <laughs> the next day. Yeah. So the next morning, I'm up early because I I bet on football, and in in the West Coast, you had to wake up early. So I'm sitting down there in the sports book, and I'm just having a few drinks and I'm, uh, you know, uh, watching football and eventually football's over. And uh, I'm like, Hey, you want to know why? I wonder where uh, Brian is. Cause we still got to go back to the to, facility. To do the, the magic gonna do show, show. Right. Yeah. Because uh, day two is the day I'm doing the magic show. Right. And, and so uh, Justin's like, uh, Hey man, what's up? And I was like, Oh yeah, yeah, no, I think we got everything figured out on the supplies for everything. Um, and, and Justin's like, well, come on down. So we go down and it's like, well, let's hit one of the tables. And so I try to seduce Justin into doing the craps experience, you know, the whole hail Minoku shouting. It's, it's amazing because it's basically you build a stock portfolio based on the idea that 9-11 will never happen. And then everyone cheers louder and louder the more money is made, and then 9-11 happens. And by 9-11, I mean wow. somebody rolls an 11. Wow. <laughs> or 7-11 wow. happens. Wow. That's what it is. Wow. <laughs> wow. And, so, and, then, uh, and then everybody acts surprised, July like, 11? oh, golly. I mean, I guess I mean nobody saw that coming, right? I mean, it's not like we could have predicted that a 7 would be rolled and all of the money would be taken away. Is that is that not how gambling works? Am, am I wrong? Uh, uh, no, Brian's new character, man who only has national disaster analogies. This <laughs> 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 is true. It's, it weighs very so anyway, heavily on you his know, mind. You know, is a lot like the Oklahoma Federal <laughs> Building. Oh, <box>. Jesus Christ. <laughs> you started it. Oh my God! I, I was just thinking. Everybody really I, I, forgot I'll about that take, one. I was just. Thinking I'll be to take you over to video poker, or as <laughs> I call it, Watergate. I ran oh, out of gee, gas. All right. <laughs> <laughs> no moves on that one. So, so no. uh, uh, unfortunately, like uh, all of the craps tables were full, and we briefly considered like trying to big time somebody into opening up another craps table, but instead we sit down. At uh, at a, a blackjack. blackjack table, and I lay down a hundred dollars on the table. And the moment I lay that down, I think this money is spent. It's money I'm never getting back. It's gone. Uh, the question is, how much fun will I get to have with this? Okay, hold on. Now I know that that's in general the mindset you need to have, both to make money and to have fun in Vegas, which. Uh, either of which are the only two outcomes that you really want, right? Nobody wants to nobody wants to go to the place where money is legendarily taken and be like, fuck, I took my money, right? Well, so you if, gotta, you gotta... if you'll remember, Justin, I sat down and pointedly looked at the dealer and said, I would like to lose this money very slowly to the casino <laughs> with brief moments of believing I might come out ahead. But <laughs> also, I don't know how much of that is you just doing the, the like, I'm Brian at a blackjack table, like, <laughs> stick. Like... <laughs> I mean, uh, 100% of it is. Know. Here's all I know. I believe right up until one very specific moment, you were probably just playing blackjack the way you always have blackjack, which is why I love playing with you, which is that it's always a very fun experience. Everybody has a good time. However, <laughs> I have played blackjack with you where it is fun and it is exciting, and at the end, you just walk away with money because you've got money in front of you, right? Yeah. I knew that you were not taking any money home with you. <laughs> when no, at what you, point? At what when, point? When we got our first withering stare from uh, the rest of the table. Because <laughs> I, for whatever reason, have gone my entire life not playing blackjack 
with the where where you you don't show your cards. It's always been dealt face up. Uh, that's just is uh, uh, for. I've not played a lot of blackjack in casinos for whatever reason. This had always been the reality, and I did not understand this strange new custom of 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 how blackjack was played. Right, so, uh, and, and for for the listeners, this is two deck blackjack, which is all face down. So they deal all the cards face down, and so you're supposed to reach forward with one hand, kind of you know pick them up, you know like your James Bond, take a peek, nod sagely, and then set it back down, and either scrape the cards toward you to indicate I would like another, or push them underneath the chips to indicate I don't I don't want any more. Yeah, so. Brian immediately goes into night attack bit about my inability to know how to play blackjack. I definitely, and, I definitely uh, started loudly mocking you and and doing it as if it were a bit like like he was playing yes, a character and doing like, can you believe this guy? Like he doesn't know how to play blackjack. Like, oh my god, what is this? Like, uh, I forgot what you were saying with, with two hands on the table. It was, uh, oh yeah, no. Brian just keeps loudly saying. What is this a séance? Is this a séance? <laughs> <laughs> With both hands on his cards. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Bad friend. <laughs> <laughs> it is eventually funny to me. I mean, I mean, it's like, it's like, it's very funny Your to two me. strong uh, hands. <laughs> <laughs> The people at our table, which I will describe as a woman in her late 50s and her uh, age-appropriate husband. <laughs> age-appropriate husband? Uh, were not pleased. Nor was uh, the gentleman uh, to Brian's left, who was barely containing his uh, vitriol. Well, okay, 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 so at first they were confused, and... Um... <laughs> and we would ask questions like, jeez, uh, oh, it's already hard for me to access. But uh, we were asking questions like like dumb beginner questions, and then they were, like, helping. And then the moment they tried to help, I couldn't help but night attack style just going like, oh, so you do it that way. You do it that way. And then I hit Justin on the shoulder and we're like, that makes more sense because then you'll win more. Brian was also you'll doing this very <laughs> awful character that I hated <laughs> all weekend. <laughs> Was it the Jewish mother? Is that I, what I don't know. Yes, to be? I, you're the one who ascribed a religion to it. <laughs> I, 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 I mean, I was, I was just amazed. I, have you seen all of this before? This is amazing. This is amazing. Call. We're sitting at a table. We're having some blackjack. You just hit, just point, just point, and say, "Hit, hit me, hit, hit, just hit it, hit." I'm gonna say three, and you say, "Hit it, three, hit it, hit." Three actual hours one night of this character <laughs> torturing me in the hotel room. I was kind of jealous about going until the con crud, and then now, like that's <laughs> mm, no. So, so we are we are at this table, and it is it, beca it becomes very very clear at a certain point that they don't like us, and we have already gone too far on us having a good time. Okay, right, well, and like, and. I feel like we were on even footing. We were a strange curiosity that were tolerable until we started winning, <laughs> at which point we became insufferable. So uh, we start winning. Uh, 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 meanwhile, also, uh, I have now uh, b begun uh, deciding to troll the people. And so it's like at some point somebody says something about Donald Trump and his Twitter. And uh, – I just the guy next to me is like, oh yeah, I bet you the president's gonna tweet it, and I'm like, uh, wait, who? No, <laughs> but, <laughs> By like, the way, uh, Ted uh, wait, wait, what is he? What is he? What is he gonna do? He's like, uh, he's gonna tweet it on Twitter, <laughs> Twitter.com. He's like, yeah, <laughs> like uh, the the thing that Shaquille O'Neal's on. He's like, uh, like yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, Donald, the president of the United States. <laughs> Has a Twitter account. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are such assholes. <laughs> but I, I'll tell you, what, it seems like he can get himself in trouble. Uh, uh, that doesn't seem like a good idea. And, and of course, I'm back in his play. I'm just like, oh man, an unfettered access. I mean, it seems like that'd be good for the American public. You know, finally we get to hear what 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 our dear leader really means when he and, says things. I don't know. Seems uh seems dicey. <laughs> Twitter, huh? To you. 140 characters, Justin. Only 140 characters. No more. Yeah. 
and uh, from from the White House. Huh. The president, oh. the president, Justin, from the president of these United States. So imagine at this. this. Point, at this point, um, people start sitting down uh, that are their friends, the other guy's friends. They start sitting down next the to them. The table is now filled us. out, and they swap dealers. So now we have a new dealer who didn't watch any of the ramp up. We have a table full of friends <laughs> of people. And at this point... I get dealt. By the way, by the way, we are a two-man act, except for one brief moment that happens while they're changing dealers. Let's say that the woman's name was Angela, and that the new dealer's name is Darren, and she's like, "Oh, like Angela." We're like, "Angela, goodbye." And then Darren's coming over. And she's like, "This is Darren," and I go, "D man," and Brian just goes. <laughs> Ooh. I lost it. I lost it when when the D man comment happened. So <laughs> so. Uh, very quickly, I get dealt a 12, which is the worst hand to be dealt. Uh, and then, and the dealer has like a, a nine showing or something. And so I say, and so it comes to me, I was like, man, 12, 12, that's rough. With the nine showing, just seems like, uh, just seems like it's bad for me, Just It seems like the worst, the worst, the dumbest thing I could do would be to slides $25 forward to match the $25 bet. Double down on a 12 with a 9 showing. It just seems like the dumbest thing. I, I want you to know that although the Brian Brushwood that you know and love is indeed a raconteur who is not afraid to pad a story here and again to make sure it flows better, what Brian has said to you right now, if you had a recording of exactly how long that took every time he had any kind of unfavorable hand for him to start doubling down on it. That is exactly the length of time it took. It was like 30 seconds of Brian like hemming and hawing like, ha, huh, wow, tell you what, a 12, wow, oh, geez. I mean, that's not good at all. Dealer, is that good? I guess it's not good. I guess the only thing I should do, and everyone's like, yeah, you're going to double down. Double down! <laughs> Three out of four times, I won. By the end, uh, the fifth time was the best one because at this point, like, I, by the way, once I started winning, because I knew this money was not going to land, I just gave it to literally everyone. I gave, oh, I gave $5. I was giving $5 to anybody who walked by, <laughs> whether or not they were an employee of the casino or not. Yes. At one point, the, the, the drink girl came, and I, I got a drink, and I gave her $5. And then I hadn't finished the drink by the time she came back. And she goes, uh, more cocktails? I was like, no, but would you like $5? <laughs> and then I gave her $5. Um the, uh, you kept, kept tipping the dealer whenever, I, whether win or lose, you would give the dealer five dollars. Yes, and then uh, I, I probably gave away eighty dollars. Um, <laughs> and then at one moment, at one moment, keep in mind this is double deck uh, blackjack, so they deal the cards face down. At one point, I was like, like came to me, and I was like, hmm, I haven't even looked at my cards, but you got a ten showing. And uh, and I got two face down cards. <laughs> it just seems, it just seems like the dumbest, the dumbest thing I could do. I mean, just the dumbest thing I could do. <laughs> and I slide a twenty five dollar chip over. It was like his double down on cards I haven't even seen. I haven't even looked at these, and you've got a ten showing. And then. And so, and so they do it, and they flip over my cards, and they can't take my bet because I have a blackjack. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, wait, I did not know this. Yes! They just canceled out your stupid, <laughs> they, shitty bet. Yes, yes because they're like, like, you won No, the sir, best you have way. a blackjack. We can't continue with this bet. <laughs> <laughs> they, <laughs> they, <laughs> Oh, and, and so the best part is I get I get up, 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 and you can feel the whole table go cold, but I'm not performing for the table. I'm only performing for Justin, right? Yeah. Oh, no. And by the way, we're just laughing maniacally. <laughs> we, are, we are clearly only trying to amuse ourselves, and we keep trying to make conversation. Oh, wait. At a certain point, Brian lends me money to double down because I am down. Yeah, you're so out. I, you're I, out. I, yeah, I, I do not have enough money to double down. And Brian is like, oh, well, I'll stake you. So he throws in the money to stake me. Uh, it winds up, my ship comes in. Uh, I wind up uh, uh, taking in all the money, and I refuse to give Brian not only none of the winnings, but also his stake back. Like, I'm just not <laughs> going to give him his stake back. This was back. warmly received by the rest of the table, <laughs> by the way. 
not warmly received is Brian then saying, like, well, no, then give it to somebody. Give it to somebody. Give it uh, – Give it to everybody. <laughs> everybody said <laughs> funny. And, and then so Justin, I, Justin says, Justin says, who wants $5? Zero hands go up. Like, that's how I cold just, the table I, is. I, I try to slide it, and they're, like, pushing their hands back like they don't want. And so I look, and at, at this point next to me is an old woman, probably about 70 years old. And I... Uh, I, 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 I hold up the $5 chip to her, and this is the first words that I've said to her. We have not introduced each other. We have not exchanged pleasantries. But she has just refused this $5 chip, and I just look her right in the face and say, huh, Cursed doubloons, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. So we continue to play. And keep in mind, like, I, this is me giving away money, being an asshole. I get up to, like, $300, and then eventually I, 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 I lose all the way back down to zero. And then there's this quiet pause, and then I just go, going to borrow $5. <laughs> and, then, and it's still dead quiet. Yeah. And then Justin- wait, 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 one, more, one more thing. Although, let's, 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 let's put it in here, because this, this is the end cap. The end cap is, is what happens here. At a certain point, when times are high, we're screaming and yelling at each other. At a certain point, that old lady taps me on the shoulder. <laughs> and uh, uh, we're having a good time. We're drinking. and it's, Oh, yeah. Also, it's 11 o'clock in the morning. In, in, case, <laughs> in case that has any bearing on this story, it's 11 o'clock in the morning. Uh, and uh, the lady, I'm like, I'm like, oh, okay, I wonder what this is about. And the lady just kind of like points down. And so I looked down. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Halfway through our comedy routine, somebody taps him on the shoulder, look down, and then Justin, as if, as if a camera was on him, bends over and picks up and holds up so everyone can see the <laughs> prescription medication of oxycodone that he's got in his pocket that fell out. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> just in case there was any uh, Sherlock doesn't need any more clues. <laughs> and so, and so, uh, so at any rate, uh, I I go down to nothing. Of, and the pregnant pause. I'm like, can I borrow five dollars? And he's like, yeah, sure. And then uh, and I take the five dollars. And it's dead silent. And there's smug satisfaction in the air all around me. And I just I just say, I used to be somebody. <laughs> You know, I used to, and then I go out and I'm like, I used to be throwing five dollar chips all over this place. Now look at me, and then they deal it out, and I get dealt. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Let me, let me, let me tell this from my perspective. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. Because I am looking at my cards, and then uh, uh, Brian just taps me on the shoulder and just same even keel tone. Well, can I borrow five more dollars? And I don't even look at his face, man. We have been brothers for so long. I just blind left hand slide him another five dollar chip when i train my eyes on the hand that he has shown <laughs> brian what is it i got a 12 i had to double down <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh man it was the best hundred dollars i've ever spent in my entire life that that 90 minutes was the most joyful 90 minutes i've ever experienced ever Oh man, the the, the, the number you twelve for three down. children being born, and you're not thrilled about that. But... Uh, maybe you should have been charging me a dollar per minute. That's apparently the the key. Well, I'll tell you what. Now that you've seen how strong we are with our money, uh, you can give us more <laughs> by going to Patreon.com/slash Night Attack. That is where. We go ahead and fund this show. Thank you guys so much for being uh, uh, so awesome uh, uh, throughout uh, your lives. In fact, every moment of your life, know that we are looking down on you uh, in judgment. Yeah, but you also know what? In, uh, in uh, cheer. A lot of patrons act like all you're doing is supporting independent creators, but we like to think that we're going a step beyond. We like to think that we are um, disembodying our spirits and looking at you at all times while you're pooping, while you're in the shower. While you're making sweet, sweet love to your significant other, we're there. We're there. But only if you sign up at patreon.com slash night attack. I have to cough. Yeah. Uh, Also, nice. Nice. We've been looking at you. (laughs) Like what we see, for the record. (laughs) Pretty good. Big time. 
Doing killing. it right. <laughs> You're killing me. Yeah. Uh, and, of course, if you make a new pledge or raise your pledge, you are eligible for the... Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the Night Attack new Patreon name chant corner hour. It's an hour of it. <laughs> All right, man. I am 100% completely convinced that not only is this a real person, but this is one of the people who was at the table with us. At... Oh my God, really? Yeah, no, I, 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 I can't tell if it was the old man, the other old man, the third old man, or the old lady. Or wow. maybe okay. Uh, uh, well, well, uh, that's. I mean, they must have really, really put uh, done a good acting job because they seem to hate us. Well, I mean, uh, that's part of the act. I mean, that's that's what they're gonna do, Justin. They're they're just gonna pretend to not God, be I bemused. Hate, I hate <laughs> it so much. <laughs> I'm with you. In fact, if you if you join By Patreon way, right now, it's, it's Bert shockingly... promises never to do that again. <laughs> it's shockingly close to my Stossel impression. No. 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 Okay. All right. No. <laughs> well, I don't know who you are, but I want to say thank you, Nicholas, Nicholas last, last name. name. Nicholas, last name. Nicholas, last name. That's you. I don't know what you're doing. You're probably trolling some old people while playing blackjack. Nicholas, Nicholas last name. Last name. Oh, maybe it's Saint Nick. Santa Claus. Nicholas. 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 On our Twitch channel, that is twitch.tv slash night attack. Uh, uh, we go full cam girl uh, uh, for uh, for a few minutes here. Oh, uh, my God. Sun Sunbun. Thank you, Sunbun. 500. Uh, Sunbun. 500 butt flashes for you, Sunbun. Thank 500 you. bits. Thank you, the bio cow. Oh, the Crimson Thank Zamboni. You. I loved you in that, uh, in that Perry Grip song. Thank you. Hey, by the way, September uh, is extended. Now it's uh, September too. Thank Go. you, Havoc One Seventy. Thank you. Sub hype time. <laughs> thank you, Seven Isu. Also, and uh, Logan WTF. Thank you. Derek you can, C1. I'll tell you what. I'll send you my my private Skype. Logan Ooh. W WTF. <laughs> thank you. Get some, whoa. <laughs> Uh, Thank you, Jaking206. Double down on uh, maids for jury to poop on. I pooped in my I pooped in my bathroom while my maid was cleaning it today. Oh Jesus! Wait, what? Like, like actively while she was like? No, I had to kick her out, but she was in the middle, and I just knew that she had to deal with the smell of my shit Ooh. while she cleaned my bathroom. Thank you, it Jack Devaney. <laughs> Appreciate your cheers. You can use uh, Justin's bathroom when you come. Uh, thank provided Jesus. you clean the rest of the apartment. <laughs> uh, uh, folks, go ahead and uh, find us. Twitch.tv slash Night Attack. And uh, uh, there you can uh, support us. Should have some big fun stuff happening. Oh, my God. By the way, Sandwich Brad. Oh, my Gee. God. 15,000 and 15 bits Hot taking over googly the dig Thank you very much, everybody. Who's well done. In. Well done. Well done. Good God. Yeah, absolutely. All right, everybody. Uh, uh, hey, uh, Bryce, we got ourselves a little game. We do have a little bit of a game. Mm. I, uh, You know, I, I, I like data. I like products. You, I, I, I'm sorry. You uh, Say both of those words again because like... neither the they yeah, – say them with your big, strong hands. <laughs> <laughs> You can't run your character over my character. <laughs> <laughs> or somebody else's character over your character. Wait, yeah. this is getting really weird. <laughs> no, wait, hold on. Wait, all right, here. Let's 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 do a thing. Uh, 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 Brian's new character, the ocean. You uh, uh, activate uh, uh, Australian male Siri to uh, uh, open the program that involves Bryce talking whatever crazy stuff he's talking. Bruh, me, the ocean. Uh, <clears throat> Australian Siri, please open. Uh, Australian Siri, uh, will you please activate 
program Bryce Castillo's game for Night Attack. Okay, I'll just go ahead and open this up with my big straw. Hey, that's, that's good. That's good. That's what. Oh, oh my God! You destroyed. You're tearing him I, apart. I, He's I, into I pieces now. I'm right there. Yeah, and I open it. I, I, okay, look. Uh, there's only one yes! thing. Dispo no, you have to do your bit. What was your products and services oh, thing? That was my Tim Cook impression. Anyway, uh, I <laughs> do, do I still well, need I to be here on the ocean? <laughs> No, I, uh, I, 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 all right. Well, this predictably went about as well as the ocean talking to Australian male Siri to activate. <laughs> the I, I, uh, I, I was, I was, I was thinking back to our, uh, teens coolness game from a few months ago. Yeah. Touching teens. Which, te which brands touch teens? Yeah. Yeah. Wait a minute, wait, 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 which which one? Because you played the same sounders and uh, video effects for seven games at no, this no, point. No, 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 that was Revenge of the Killennials, which was a different, very bad bit that, that went on a little too long. Uh, but I, 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 I went in search of data to uh, build a new game for today, and I was really happy to find one. I want to uh, give a, a shout out to... Uh, the gentleman who actually compiled a lot of this stuff, Shaquin GV. Uh, Shaquin GV! He's my favorite subject, not in the sea. He's probably on land somewhere. He hasn't returned my calls. I'm the ocean. You're the ocean. Anyway, see you later. See you later. <laughs> there we go. It's the ocean, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, uh, I, I, he, he, he put together a really great... Um, uh, set of data that I made to make this game, which I, I wanted to call Google Feud, which you can't call it because there's already the other app that does Google Feud. So this is uh, Fugal. Uh, do -do -do. Wait, Fugal. Fugal. Oh, hello, I'm your host, The Ocean. Welcome to Fugal Feud, a totally independent game, separate from Family Feud, a registered trademark of some company that owns it. Joining oh, us now is your pay. host. Uh, 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 for those of you who are just listening, Bryce just has a Family Feud logo on <laughs> like, oh. that. Oh, uh, I, I, I don't see any such copyrighted logo, I'll tell you that much. No trademarks here. Take it away, Bryce. So we're going <laughs> to... So he put together this really great visual interactive, and we'll, we'll, uh, we'll have the show notes. We'll, have, we'll, put a, we'll try to put a link at the show notes uh, about what people use Google for and the things that they use Google to find out how to do. So we're gonna we're gonna play three rounds of uh, a how to family fugal. Uh, we're gonna get a category, and you're uh, you're just gonna go. Uh, we're gonna play family feud style, and you're gonna try and guess what people most looked for in those categories. Okay. Okay. So uh, we'll start off with with Brian. You'll be team one. Sure. And Justin will have you as team two. Oh wow! Look at these and transitions. This uh, is production value. <laughs> Your Patreon dollars at work. Oh my God! You should. This tune is also in. a fully built other game for the shh, family. Shh, 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 yeah, shh, this shh, is shh, definitely shh. a PowerPoint presentation shh. template. Uh, so the, uh, uh, the the first category is cooking stuff. Uh, cooking stuff. Things things that people Googled to find. There we go. This PowerPoint is a, is not exactly airtight. It's got it's got farty splooge sounds. It has a farty splooge sound. So there, right. there are eight answers on the board. Yeah, uh, I want you guys to tell me what uh, people people were using Google. Uh, uh, the the general the general format for these are how to blank. Okay, got it. How to blank. So uh, we'll uh, we'll start with Brian. Wait, most popular how to question how, in food stuff. In food stuff. So we'll do we'll do this kind of fastest finger around. Sure, 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 sure. How to boil. <laughs> how to boil. Boil. Uh, I Boiled. cannot give you how to boil. Boil water. Uh, Justin. Mm -hmm. uh, how to uh, have sex. <laughs> In food stuff. In food stuff. <laughs> oh, wait. Too oh, late. Yeah, too late. Sure. <laughs> too late. That's oh, his yeah. pick. That's his pick. I'm sorry. Go uh, with it. No. <laughs> uh, Brian. Bonnie. <laughs> oh, yeah. Bonnie, you want to play? How to cut a grapefruit for sex. <laughs> <laughs> How to cut a grapefruit. Mm, I don't also think I can. For oral sex. I'm sorry. Can I clarify? <laughs> oral, oral sex. sex. <laughs> oral sex. Yeah. No. Good okay. answer. Good uh, answer. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> something <Right>. with steak. <laughs> something with steak. <laughs> No, I, what? something with steak is not in the top eight answers. 
on how to uh, food stuffs. Uh, how to make pasta? Uh, how to make pasta? I will give you number eight. How to cook rice? Ah, boo! Uh, that's not pasta. Rice is a pasta. <laughs> no, yeah. the starch. Yeah. The starch. All right. All right. Do you want to play or pass, Justin? Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, uh, no, I'm gonna pass. Uh, uh, Brian, uh, you guys, you, you, you. All right, and I got this. I got this. I got this. All right. All right. Here we go. How to wash vegetables? Mm. Eh. Hit the wash the vegetable. Oh. There we go. No. No. Fuck. Uh, I'm I'm gonna give everybody uh, a, a little bit of a hint. This is kind of. Food based. Wait, is vegetables okay? The mere fact that he's Wait. saying that. Food. Based. How to food. So like when food, you said food. how to boil that how to boil is not based on preparing food. Got it. Food. Okay. Okay. Oh. Uh, okay. How to season chicken. How, oh. So how to say good answer. Good answer. How to season <laughs> yeah. chicken. I love the fact that we're a family. How, how, to, see, how to season chicken. Oh, it broke. This is a new way. No. <laughs> So that's strike one. All right, all right. Uh, six, strike seven two. more answers are really on the board still. Uh, that has been hidden. Uh, yeah, how to, how to, uh, um, how to uh, uh, cook an egg. An egg. Good answer. Okay, show me <coughs> the PowerPoint. The PowerPoint. <laughs> oh my god. What are you? Oh man, that's, that's good. That's good. That means I'm gonna win. What, what? An egg. So we'll, we'll give you we'll, we'll give you rice and we'll, we'll give it boiled boil eggs, eggs for twenty one. Um. Okay. All right. One strike. All right, Bonnie. Come oh. on. Come on. What you got? What you got? What you got? All right. All right. How to scramble an egg? No. 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 Don't do eggs again. That's a bad. Uh, idea. I think it's. I think it's. Scramble. You think so? I think so. Number one. <sighs> uh, no, apparently not. Apparently not. <laughs> I thought that was a surprise. All right. Um, <laughs> I live with the magician. It's always right, shit like strike, that. One more strike. One more strike. Team mm. Rushwood. All right. All right. All right. Uh, 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 cook bacon. Cook bacon. Oh, cook yeah. Bacon. Cook bacon. Cook bacon. Show me bacon. Ah. Team mm. Gerbs. You have a chance mm. to steal. No, I I got the thing. What? Oh, shit. What do you mean yeah. you got the thing? You got rice. We spent this whole time giving you the turn, but we gave him right. Oh, no, he passed. I passed. Oh, he passed. I passed. Okay, so, so I you win. get to steal. I win, yeah. No, 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 you still have to get one. You have to run the table, yeah. No, no, no. You still have to get one. You have to clear the board. No, we actually, he doesn't. Yeah, yes, he, he does. doesn't. That's what it means why? to pass. What? That's, that's why, by the way, for the record, anybody who ever that's ends ridiculous. up on, on on Family Feud, the smartest move you can make is to pass. Is this real? Yeah, no, that's that's a real thing. Well, okay. Pass uh, gas Congratulations, all the meds. Justin Robert Young. <laughs> So you only got 35 points. So you got 35 points. All right. Oh, All wait. Right. We're done. Oh, because we. Wait, we... people are saying no. People are saying no. You have See, you have to have a chance to the, steal. Yeah. I, you have to a whole steal. steal. Mm. Oh, so sorry. Everyone's everyone's saying. Everyone's saying. Cool. I don't even know that I can fix this. All right. Well, uh, steal. give me. Give, uh, what do you got? Justin, Justin, steal literally anything. Uh, yeah. All right. So, uh, you. Boil <laughs> eggs and rice. Well, okay. Well, you know, I mean, the biggest thing. Uh, Australian that, uh, Siri. Uh, Australian Siri. How do I? Uh, uh, how do I uh, tenderize meat with my big strong hand? <laughs> <laughs> that sounds kind of sexy. Uh, 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 eh. Oh. Tenderized meat is not. Not on there. On the list. Uh, oh, so that means we get 35 points. Yeah, Team Rushwood, now you're team two. Ah. Uh, all right, let's go down the list here. Number seven. Oh wait. Okay. What? What's up, Bonnie? I I don't know how this game is played. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right, number seven. How to make <laughs> buttermilk. buttermilk? Fuck you. What? <laughs> what? I don't even know people that use buttermilk actually know how to use the hey, internet. Man. That's some, confusing. Some to of me. us got on TV shaking buttermilk. Oh, Jesus. Number six. This is true. Asparagus. Asparagus. What? Number five. Turkey. Turkey. Wait, we're just naming words that, that we, how? 
We're just naming foods? How to cook a turkey. How to cook a turkey. Uh, wait, it, was this was pizza? This, was this bit just name some foods? <laughs> keep, uh, keep, keep, going, going. keep going. Okay. It's going great. French, French toast. toast. Oh, wait, 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 wait. The next one is how to cook sushi. Sushi? Because you don't cook it. All right. Ah. Okay. Pancakes. Oh, right. sure were some foods. <laughs> Those are those are to clarify. Those are the most popular search terms with how to how to cook stuff. Blank. Mm. These are cooking search terms. Yeah, uh, based on Google data. Mm. On gotcha. Google data. On the data from Google, Justin. Wait, no, no, no. But say it like Tim Cook. Is that data? Ba- based data on and how to cook buttermilk. Yeah. How do you how cook make, bu- buttermilk? buttermilk? You ever think? You ever even think of these things? I don't. That's why no. the internet's smarter than you. Hmm. She's got Jesus. it all figured out. All right. Uh, let, let's let's go. Let's go fast. Okay. okay. All right. Uh, Justin, you're gonna start the fast finger. Uh, number round two. This category is. Uh, oh fuck me. Oh fuck me. No. Okay. Uh, these are oral. <laughs> these are anal. Uh, <laughs> Sixty nine. Hand job, <laughs> leg fucking. So these are <laughs> cuckoldry. All right, there we go. Uh, these are search terms. These are the a big t- hole in your ear, like those people that have those big spacers. <laughs> oh, Glory no! holes. This doesn't happen. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> Funny is half broken. and half. The, the, this <laughs> double <laughs> anal. All right, this Butter category milk. is the top Google search terms for appliances. How to fix appliances around the house? <laughs> so we've got appliances six appliances. Okay. Donkey punch. <laughs> Docking. Great Justin, fruit. you're starting. You're starting the fast finger. Give me got- a. Fastest finger! <laughs> Good one, the Dutch oven! <laughs> Reach around? <that> <laughs> Alright, Justin. Yeah. Uh, yeah, give me, give me uh, the, the, the fastest finger. The cursed doubloon! <laughs> <laughs> the old lady sees your oxycotton on the ground. <laughs> We're double down on 12. What are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, all right, Justin. The uh, 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 so give me appliances. give me appliances. Appliances. These are based on Google search trends for the United States. Now, uh, real quick, uh, is it how to fix blank or just just the buying or how to fix? How to fix, how and to fix. then blank is all right. Uh, toaster, toaster, toaster. Damn, damn. Show me toaster. Oh, mm. <clears throat> uh, Russian. Washing machine. Show me washing machine. 27 Woo! points. Number three. All right. Do you want to play or pass? I want to pass. With the understanding you do have to steal. Yeah, no, okay. I'm I'm comfortable with this. Okay. Pass. All right, Justin. How to fix yeah, it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and go with toilet, Bryce. I'm going to go with toilet. Toilet, where I took a poop and then somebody had to clean it again <laughs> after I pooped in it today. Double anal. Show me toilet. <laughs> Number one uh, with 34 points. All right. Well, you want to know what? This is always my favorite thing on, on, on Family Feud is the cocky ass fucking arrogant families that like like to spin their own little fucking stories mm. like around their answers where it's like, well, I think I'm going to take this answer watching my flat screen TV. <laughs> Oh, your answer is flat screen TV. Flat screen TV. Why, why are you wearing a monocle for this? I was pulling down my glasses because I wear sunglasses because I'm watching my flat screen TV. You want, you want TV? Won't that polarize it out? Uh, I want. I want to. I want a, a flat screen TV. Is what I'm talking about. Oh, oh. No flat screen TV. Water heater. Water heater. Bonnie, it is not your Bonnie, turn. Wait, wait, Justin, wait not he our, got an X. He, got, he needs three X's. <laughs> ah, Jesus, have you ever even shit. seen the show? I... 
with my big strong hands. <laughs> 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 How to fix appliances. Uh, uh, I, I'll tell you what, I think I'm going to have this answer in a minute and a half <laughs> once I get it out of the microwave. <laughs> <laughs> Show me microwave. Oh! Uh, strike two. Justin, uh, 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 well, I'll, I'll tell you what, this answer is going to be on ice once I get it out of the... Refrigerator freezer. <laughs> Show me your refrigerator. <laughs> Number two, Ooh. answer fridge. That was a good one. Hey man, just so you know, I got I got five dollars waiting for you. Just when you run out, I'll I'll loan I, you. I I think that this one's gonna go up in smoke when I walk into my walk-in humidor. <laughs> 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 All right, show me walking humidor. Show it to me. <laughs> All right, uh, Team Rashford, you have one chance Bonnie, to steal. He, he did not take your, your guess. What I was know that guess? was very gentlemanly. What was your guess? I said dishwasher or water heater. No, water yeah, heater. Yeah, water heater. There's water heater. Water heater. Water heater. USA. USA. All right, show me water heater. Show to me. <laughs> uh, no way! Oh, they break all the time. Oh. So all congratulations. Right. That goes to Justin on team one now. Oh, wait. It goes back points. to Justin? Oh, well, yeah. No, no, no. He, he got those points. He got those points. Yeah. Show me number six. Oh. Outlet. Outlet. Uh. Show me number five. ATST. Sink. <laughs> Sink. Oh. And number four. Light blob. Okay. Those are not appliances. I, okay. Are you, are you, yeah. Those are. Are you going to argue with Steve Harvey? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Because now, because hold Bryce, on here, Bryce does an amazing Steve Harvey. You want to talk to <laughs> Steve Harvey? You do it right now. You talk to Steve <laughs> Harvey. <clears throat> Uh, excuse me, Mr. <laughs> Steve Harvey. I, yeah. I take issue with some of these answers because I don't think that some of these are appliances. <laughs> what? Huh? <laughs> oh, can they? Can they? What? <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so Asian. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Well, actually, let's uh, uh, hold on. Wait a minute. I, I think I got a I got a a, a real quick uh, a YouTube clip uh, uh, queued up here. This is Steve Harvey. That famous night that he uh, that that he uh, screwed up the end of that uh, that that beauty pageant. Let's go ahead and oh I'm hitting God, play. Oh oh click play God. and we're clicking play now. We're watching it and uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everyone. I this is on me. This is on me. I what I what <laughs> this was still a great night. This was, can they even do that? What? All right, Bryce. Can we can we time? Let's just call time. Time. Right, Dave, this is not in my little little huddle. Huddle. Team huddle. Yes, team huddle. <laughs> Literally, I threw to you. I I put the spotlight on you because the impression was all non-words. Like literally, all you had to do for the impression was just hua, hua, hua. So that's all you had to do. You don't have to say like maybe at the end you say the one word and then it's a funny thing. But literally, all you got to do is hua, hua, hua. That's it. <laughs> got it. Heard, understood, so, internal. Right, you you, you, you want to back right, it up? Right. We'll play it again. Play sure. it again. Yeah, yeah you do. Yeah, you want to hit the play button on that? Sure, sure. Button. All right. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, so this is that famous time, Brian, when uh, Steve Harvey wrote that uh, that really mean letter to all of the people that worked on his show. This is that entire letter spoken with words, verbatim. <laughs> Let's go ahead and hit play on that written letter S- right S- now. Uh, side note before we hit play, his <laughs> pants are around his ankles and go, go. And we're hitting play. What? Yeah. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Can they? What? What? Sincerely, dear uh, Steve Harvey. <laughs> Right, for the, dear Steve Harvey. For yes, the audio yes. listeners, right, he answer. looked left, he looked right, he <laughs> he patted his chin. 
<laughs> he looked up and grabbed his hair. I don't know. All right. We've got our final round. To the point. Frugal. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, I don't know why I cut off like that. This is not a great PowerPoint presentation. Uh, love stuffs. We're looking for search terms related to love. How to blank is still the format. The category is love stuffs. How how to how to in. sex? People yeah. want to know how to sex. How to? He's saying do. love. Yeah, I know. Love. People love to sex. Mm. All right. Okay, yeah, there we go. How to sex. How to sex. Got it, got it, got it. How to. Oh, you know what? I'm sorry. I made a mistake. Everyone, this is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Steve Harvey. Wow. Steve Classic Harvey. Steve if you go to Dog Classic. <laughs> Can they even. <laughs> uh, 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 sorry, that is a, another category that I did not put in this uh, quiz. This is uh, uh, health related stuff. How uh, to sex. <laughs> no? Okay. All so right. This is how to's. How to search terms related to health, not uh, romance and sex. Sorry. Uh, How to so Brian. lance a boil or pimple. How to lance a boil or pimple. Yeah. Yeah. How do you how do you poke a hole in a dome and make some squeezy juice? Squeezy juice. Brian. How do you make the squeezy Brian. juice right. come out? Too far. Too make the far. squeezy juice. Squeezy juice. Squeezy juice. Squeezy juice. All right, all right. Show Squeezy me. Squeezy juice. Squeezy juice. Oh! Get rid of acne. We are <laughs> number two. We are giving you getting rid of acne because Squeezy juice. We combine that with get rid of pimples. Squeezy juice. So you got oh, squeezy juice. Squeezy, I'm coming for you. Somebody I'm having a heart attack. I'm gonna die. and go to squeezy juice heaven, where all my pimples oh. went to after I oh. busted them. Although somebody did say how to masturbate, squeezy juice. That's also squeezy <laughs> juice. <laughs> Okay. Although I it doesn't get rid of acne, that's a misconception. Juke. Oh Jesus! All right, oh, Jesse, Brian. can you beat? Get rid of acne. Number the number two answer. These are how to health search terms. Uh, wait, uh, Brian passed. Hey, uh, no, you have to. You ha you get a you chance have, to. You beat have a his chance to oh, beat in fast okay, fingers. Yeah. So although I'm your fingers that, uh, aren't going to be fast enough to get that squeezy juice out. Number one answer on the board: lose weight. Show me lose weight. Mm. Oh. Let me point out that that squeezy juice makes you lose weight, <laughs> just not a lot. Yeah, okay. just, just are you a juicer? Pops out. Are you gonna are you play a or juicer, pass, Brian? No, no, I'm gonna pass. You're gonna pass. All right, Brian. Pass rushing for that ass. Four answers mm -hmm. left on the board. How to search terms? How to health. build muscle? Squeezy juice. <laughs> is squeezy juice part of the answer? <laughs> no, I'm just uh, it's it's a uh, it's a uh, it's a little tick I have. Oh, oh, I'm so very sorry about that. Show me gain muscle. Oh! We're gonna give you gain weight on that one. All right, three All right. answers left on the board. Bonnie, mm. give me a how to health search term. Ooh. Tell the truth. Keep what? in mind, squeezy juice was on the board. Uh, <laughs> How to uh, get, Cooter plug. get rid of gingivitis. What? No. Oh. <laughs> you, would you uh. really think that's what everybody this is? The top Show six. me. Get rid of gingivitis. <laughs> God damn it. Uh. No, it turns out not in the top six. <laughs> Look, you okay. got to say bad breath. Bad breath. Bad breath. Bad oh. breath. <laughs> is that your answer? Yeah. Bad breath. <laughs> Just show me bad breath. Uh. Ah. Yeah, these are the top search terms. Wait, you're saying that breath results. isn't a top concern? Mm. All right. Um, Double down on 12. Uh, what about, all right, here we go. Here we go. Uh, last one. Oh. <laughs> uh, I used to have spikes and now my beard's too long. I used to have spikes and now my beard's too long. All right, show me. <laughs> used to have spikes and now my beard's too long. Uh, uh, Justin, can you give me one of these last well, three answers? Well, now I'll tell you what, I don't need to wear a hat for this one, Steve, because I've already learned how to regrow my hair. <laughs> uh, All right, for the game, show me regrow hair. Show me your hair. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Do -do -do. Do -do -do. Do -do -do.
do, 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 do. So just by the skin of their teeth, the Brushwoods <laughs> take the game 215 what? to 186. What? Bon- Bonnie's <laughs> genuinely like, holy shit, we won something. I can't believe it. <laughs> wait, just- what, wait, what were the rest of them? Oh, right. We got to show you the rest of them. Number six. <laughs> Lower blood, 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 wow. blood pressure. Wow. Pressure. Number five. Yeah. Meditate. Oh, fuck wow. off. <laughs> and number four. Fall, fall asleep. asleep. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, all right, thank you uh, so much. Uh, one more time to uh, Shaquin GV. Uh, if you want to go see, uh, if you want to go see his whole interactive, and it was actually it's actually pretty interesting. Go to uh, howtofixatoilet.com, but there are hyphens in between the words because I'm sure someone already has the regular howtofixatoilet.com. <laughs> Uh, awesome, man. Thank Nicole. you, thank you, thank you, guys, so much. Uh, those games, uh, Bryce, you got to get me those goddamn. Uh, uh, addresses so I, I can send out free stickers. I will. I will. I will. Uh, all right. Hey, uh, 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 Brian, do you want to do a little uh, diamond time? Uh, diamond time. Of course, that's the place where you could go to diamondclub.reddit.com and you could shout out your latest projects and we'll shout them out right here live on the show. You'll find a sticky post right up top at reddit.com slash r slash diamond club. And the first submission we have comes to us from uh, M- RM Del Noche. Hello, Diamond Club. Kent from Ritual Misery here. Where has this year gone? Can you believe we're three quarters of the way through 2017? That means it's already time to start planning for this year's New Year's Eve streamathon. Last year, the Diamond Club finally came together and dro- or family came to- together in droves to ring in the new year. For 27 straight hours, we were entertained. We enjoyed each other's company. We raised several thousand dollars for charity. It was awesome. We're doing it again this year, but we need your help. We're looking for streamers, both veterans and noobs, and anyone who would like to participate in the behind the scenes capacity. Help us get a head start by planning uh, the volunteering at yolo420.com slash slash streamathon. 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 I can keep saying Streamathon. 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 Would you like $5 streamathon? What? Yeah, yeah you st- uh, five dollars. Yeah, have five dollars. Double down on streamathon. <laughs> streamathon. The government won't double down on streamathon. James Rant, he says he doesn't even gamble. Uh, Camden uh, Chief Lord says, "Hello, DC buddies. I've been trying to follow the sage advice of if you build it, they will come." So, in the spirit, I've started a podcast about content creators, creativity, and inspiration. I've only done a few so far, and they have all been musicians. However, if you are a content creator, whether that be writing novels, making a politics podcast, or the host of a successful YouTube channel, I'd love to chat with you about your secret sauce that makes it happen for you to take a little peek behind the curtain and how the magic happens. Uh, it's currently a little baby and needs a little love and nourishment with a few good interviews and episodes. I hope it may be something great and self-sustaining. I am super proud of the guests I've had so far. Mike TV, Moriarty, Albert Jones, and Sarah Marie from Honey. The show is called Noise Filter Podcast. And basically what I would love more than anything is either advice on how to make it better uh, some likes and shares on Facebook and some eyeballs on YouTube and some knowledgeable guests to join me for an episode. If that is you, contact me uh, via my Facebook page, which can be found by searching the Noise Filter Podcast on Facebook or YouTube. Here's the link uh, to the most recent one with the lovely Mike TV, who, uh, can uh, can I just remind everybody, has a new album. I just landed. Don't double plug. Here we go. Uh, buy Mike TV's album, but honestly, come on. Uh, these things are too fucking long anyway. Facebook.com slash Noise Filter Podcast. Again, Facebook.com slash Noise Filter Podcast. And YouTube.com slash a long string of letters and numbers but uh go to facebook.com slash noise filter podcast sin of society writes in hey diamond club i'm going to keep this short because my emotional tank is on empty i'm really deep in the red due to medical costs trying to save my cat's life my wife is selling knitted goods to try to help and cover expenses full details are in a facebook post at yolo420.com slash other cat O-T-H-E-R-C-A-T. So please take a moment to read and share. Visibility yeah, and hopefully will get us on our feet. Go read the... There's an update. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Cool. Uh, I can read it. Uh, update. Other cat, the best kitty, oh, dear. passed today at 9 a.m. 
She was unable to keep her blood sugar due to uh, insulinoma, a type of pancreatic. Insulinoma. uh, Insulinoma, a type of uh, pancreatic cancer. We still need assistance as they'll be holding her remains until we can pay the medical expenses. Oh, Jeez. dude, that's no joke. We had that We had that happen to our Dalmatian. Our Dalmatian got sick, like had liver disease, and they you know, they keep saying, like, well, I don't know. It's like, it's like, well, how much will this cost? And they're like, well, we don't know if it'll work. Uh, it might keep your dog alive. And it's like, well, how much is it? And then they give you this withering look like, uh, hmm. Mm. And then, uh, well, and then like, it's like, okay, yeah, well, let's do thing. it. They're like... They're like, oh, yeah, your dog might just be kind of sick, but needs treatment or like it might be really sick. And then in which case it's dying. And we, well, we don't know. You right. know, well, until what do we, you want Until we do? like rob you blind and you're just like, I mean, look, I'm not, I'm not going to say that Big yeah. Vet is a cancer on the <laughs> <laughs> uh, on the cat of America. Yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> I'm just saying Such like, bummer, like though. we've been there. We've been there. We know how rough that this is. We lost our Dalmatian and. Uh, in one universe, that Dalmatian would have died with zero dollars debt. <laughs> Instead, it mm-hmm. died with uh, she died with thirty five hundred dollars. Oh, well, here, let, let me uh, somebody real quick. If you know sin of society or you are sin of society, please put that link back in the chat because the link that we have here, yolo four twenty dot com slash other cat, does not point anywhere. My my, uh, my guess would be that maybe they hid that. They post pulled that. If- the, yeah. that update. They're like, yeah, yeah, maybe they. Yeah. Well, we're, we're oh, sorry oh, for your loss. Got, oh no, it's, it's all it's all there. Okay, hold on, wait. I didn't finish. If you don't feel comfortable donating directly to us uh, and still want to do some good, please donate to a local no kill animal shelter in her name. Cats oh. without homes need love. And have lots of love to give if you give them the chance. Seriously. So, uh, yeah. um, hey man, yeah. like for, for for the record, beautiful people, like like we've been there, uh, Bonnie and I. Oh, that was rough. That was rough. You know, right now, if you live in Texas, there are a lot of pets needing homes after Harvey because people can't keep them at shelters. Oh yeah, everybody's out of their homes, and they a lot of them weren't tagged, and then they've gotten out, and so there's a lot of animals that. Uh, well, I'll tell you what. If you want to uh, have a, write a story about uh, your cat uh, uh, living, you don't. They don't need to be dying. It's fine. <laughs> Just. <laughs> To uh, Diamond Time, that is uh, reddit.com slash r slash diamond club. The sticky post right there at the top is Diamond Time. But you want to know what, Brian? What do you say we go into the movie draft minute? <laughs> That's so fun. Minute, minute, minute presented by CosmicRadio.tv for the week of October 2nd, 2017. I'm your host, Roberto Villegas. So here I am, getting a new page with a player set. It's time to pick the stage. Let's go check the scoreboard. Team Cord Killers and Frog Pants are both tied for fifth place. Still waiting for their first film. Team Feline is in fourth place with Stronger bringing in $3.1 million a week. Team Jury is in third place with American Made bringing $16.7 million a week. Team Champions are in second place with the Lego Ninjago Movement bringing in $35.2 million a week. And Flatliners bring in $6.5 million. We bring their total to $41.7 million. And in first place, the Kingsman, the Golden Circle, bring in $66.6 million. Week. And Battle of the Sexes bring in $4.0 million. Week. It's Team Big and Tall. And that is your Move Drive Minute for the week of October 2nd, 2017. Man, Justin, I feel like, uh, I feel like uh, Team... Oh, I, well, you're not Justin Robert Young at all! Uh, no, I'm not. I am, uh, uh the, 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 the scourge of the movie draft. Go uh, on. Am, what, what's your name? The, the... Uh, I, I, I am, I am the, uh, the, 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 the south of the border, uh, superstar. Yes. Go on. Uh, I, I am, I am he who, uh, uh <laughs> goes to translate to Google. <laughs> <laughs> He, the man from south of the border, the man who goes to Google Translate, uh, translate translate.google.com, the man with a craggly stash and a face full of ass. He's south of the border, Mother Crowder. That's a real word. Ladies and gentlemen, it is El Redactor de la Pelicula. Uh, 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 El oh, Reductor. Oh, oh, oh. Big man. Big 
big man you are, Brian. Oh, so big. Oh, you and Tom, you just, you were just so excited, weren't you? Just a split off. Oh, they, oh, we're team champions now. Champions like to stroke each other while we draft. We're so smart. We got the Lego Ninjago movie. Guess what, motherfucker? <laughs> Bomb City, bitch. It ain't shit. And now you're fucked. I mean, how do you respond to that, Brian? He just ate your whole lunch. Uh, I, I, I say, well, that was rude. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't. That was unnecessary and rude. The, uh, there are... uh, oh, oh, um, well, guess what? I'm, I am uh, El Redactor de la Pelicula. I don't pull fucking punches, motherfucker. Oh, man. I, I go for keeps. I go for the jugular. Okay, oh, well, uh, guess what? what else did you have? Uh, uh, El... oh, 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 what else? Oh, flatliners? Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, I didn't know uh, that that was also the description of its box office. <laughs> uh, uh, El he's taking, he's de taking de you to town, Spine. Brian. No, we had it coming. We had it coming. Look, Redactor. Reductor de Pelicula and I have a long history. Uh, Reductor de Pelicula, our rivalry aside, how do you feel about the prospects of Blade Runner 2049? Uh, you got any gum? I mean, it's certainly not going to be worth the 79,000 movie dollars that uh, Sarah Lane paid for it. <laughs> yeah, that was, a, that was a bit of a whoopsie. Uh, whoopsie doodle. Uh, no, apparently it was literally like she meant to type seven and she accidentally typed 75 and then was too proud to uh, to, to go back <laughs> to, on to it. To shut it down, yeah. Funny. Uh, uh, no, I mean, uh, Blade Runner should win the weekend, you'd assume, right? The, Did, but but I don't think that it is going to do. The buzz uh, is huge, man. The buzz is that it's gorgeous and amazing and that there's a big surprise and it's a lot of fun. No, I, I think it'll be good. I mean, but but do you think it'll do better than like Kingsman? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, I do. I, I think it'll be the bestseller so far. Really? I mean, not a science not, fiction not, movie over a spy uh, roster? Not, I mean, but, but again, this is a pedigree to a, uh, how much did the original, uh, one do? Uh, Blade the original Runner. Kingsman? No, 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 the original Blade Runner. He say you, uh, Blade I Runner. I don't know, I guess I'm going to tell I mean, I guess, in. here's, here's all I'd say. I think most modern moviegoers, more modern moviegoers would know what Kingsman is than what Blade Runner is. Yeah. Okay, wow. This is, uh, uh, Blade Runner did not make no, a Blade lot Runner of money. Uh, domestic box office was 32 million, 33 million worldwide. Not... Great. Well, I mean, yeah, Blade Runner historically did I, not make I, I, I believe it will probably make that its opening. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, yeah. All right. So about that. Uh, Versus uh, Kingsman, the first one. Made 128. Made uh, I do think I do think it's going to do close to 100 million, but not much more. I think you're right. Oh, no. I think I think 100 million is probably in 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 the realm a possibility for it, although it, it, it I think they're going to hope it makes a lot more because its production budget was 128. So, yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, hey, man, fucking PBS. Fuck those assholes. <laughs> yeah, fu <laughs> fuck them. Wait, hold on. Bryce, let's go to a full screen of you. Oh, sure. Yeah. Oh, uh, tell me more, Brian. Yeah. No, uh, 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 fucking fucking. They took away my Vietnam War. Uh, they, well, it's still in all of our hearts no but but they're they're all like uh they're all like psych you we know you love the vietnam war why don't why don't you watch more of it why don't you just make another one if you're a paid donor uh -huh. and then they flashed up their patreon page they don't have a patreon page no, but I they might as well uh, apparently apparently i can only watch the first two episodes again and now i, I so how much oh, oh shit. How they, much were they, they, they were streaming all you, 10 you, episodes you, and i hold didn't on, hold on wait, pause can we please just actually do an explanation of what the fuck you're talking about? I, I love the Vietnam War, Justin. I think it's great. It's so good. I just love the Vietnam War. I love everything about the Vietnam War. In fact, I was told that support for the Vietnam War comes from the Anti-War Foundation. Uh, uh, Joseph Goebbels and viewers like you. Joseph Goebbels? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, Unrelated. Um, the the the... The From the Connecticut Goebbels? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey man, look, I'm just uh, I'm just the conduit through which sure. the truth arrives. And this isn't the Ken Burns documentary series for PBS. No. This oh, is... you know what? I bet that is what it is. So how much? That would are, make sense. So how much do they want Wait, you to play? Wait, Joseph Goebbels. Yeah. No, for oh. for reals, he's a big fan. Huh? On Twitter. 
Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Twitter. 140 wow. characters on Twitter. Really? It's, wow. That's all you get. No more. You, Keep it more short. Brevity is the soul of wit. That's yeah. what Jesus said. From the Nazis. Goebbels. Yeah. Huh. This oh, is wow. shockingly close Weird. to the routine we were doing for those sounds poor people. Like, uh, at the table. Sounds, uh, sounds dangerous. I think it's not the World War I one. Yeah. one. They gave the it to World the president. The, the president has it. He's got a pre- it's like Nazis? a tel- it's like a telegraph from President's the president. Presidents got Nazis now? The president to us he sends messages over the Twitter. 140 characters. Oh, 140. Wow. 140. Yeah, just think Why? of all no. for none. No. But but all oh. being one. And then one. you'll remember. Okay, yeah. All is one like the binary and one. all for none. And then then you'll remember 140. That's how many ca- Although that's not even true, is it? Well, it's, I, I don't it's know. It's not even know. true anymore. Now you can do 280. They've doubled it. They've doubled the number of characters, Bryce. Did you know this? <laughs> They've doubled the characters. It's just the in, it's just the lilt. It's the, the words are the exact same. It's the lilt. <laughs> it drives you nuts. <laughs> Uh, so how much do they want you to pledge to be able to watch your can Literally anything, which is, <laughs> in my book, literally anything too much. <laughs> you love this. You've been I talking des- about this for weeks. I deserve it for free. <laughs> throw them a dollar. Throw them a bone. Okay, I'll throw them a bone. Oh, I, I really oh, can't. Hold on. I didn't know this was the kind of public broadcasting system. <laughs> I thought it was for hashtag all peeps. All yeah. peeps? Hashtag all peeps. Yes. All peebs. PBS is peebs. Uh, you and your fellow peebs can hang out and talk about the <laughs> Vietnam War at our peebs, uh, our peebs pot. Our, our peebs, <laughs> peebs pot. <laughs> peebs pot uh, hot. Peebs pop cold. <laughs> peebs pot uh, in the pot. Uh, pe- nine days um, old. But get your peebs uh, while you can, because if you don't use them, you lose them. Peeb, PBS for the peebs. <laughs> PBS, the peebs. Uh, what'll be great is when that infiltrates uh, into pe- the. Meet, meet the peebles uh, uh, when you watch Ken Burns and his new documentary about an old shoe. Oh, the many. old shoe doc with Ken Burns on the, uh, the only place for peebs, PBS. Ken Burns, uh, live on Charlie Rose. Well, I originally wanted it to be about uh, feeble people, or as I called them, feeble peebs. <laughs> but nobody wanted to buy that documentary, so I did it on a shoe instead. Back to you, Charlie Rose. It's the story. <laughs> interview with the package? He uses a toss. <laughs> he tosses back. <laughs> it's, it was a very difficult interview. A lot of people don't know this about Ken Burns is that he has a tendency <laughs> to hijack the interview by tossing back to by the person. By leaving, going remote, yeah. and then tossing. What they weren't strong in stature, they were more than strong in character. Ken Burns presents Feeble Peeves. <laughs> They they might have been brittle, but they were uh, battered uh, within an inch of their life. The sad <laughs> story of feeble peeps. Washed up on the shore of New Zealand, we interviewed this man. Hello, what's your name? Siri. <laughs> what was your job back in the mainland? <laughs> no? What was the job? All on the ocean. Anyways, we're time to wrap things up. We'll see you later. See you next Tuesday. Dino Fog. Oh no. Oh. Man, good times. Uh, we learned that we should never play blackjack again. Uh, we learned that we should play blackjack the next time we see each other. And, uh,. uh <laughs> We learned that feeble peeps come into a, a peep stop peeps. near you. <laughs> uh, we learned that uh, that Bryce does the best uh, uh, frugal. Uh, 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 frugal. Fugal. Yeah, it's fugal. 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 
He's a plant uh, well, fan of the flugel horn. I'm allergic to uh, you're not going to have to worry about dying in a fire because I'm going to bend it with my big strong head. Oh, and I'll put water all over it. I'm the ulcer. That was the pre-show bit. We didn't tell anybody that was the pre-show Oh, uh, if they were patrons at patreon.com slash talk, they'd know what this means. Also, I can't get rid of this beard anymore now that it's a functional tool. Night attack, night attack, night attack, night attack, night attack, night attack, I love you. Diamond Club hopes you have enjoyed this program. <laughs>